So if you guys clicked on this video for the best Fortnite OG keybinds, then keep watching. But before this video starts, this is the current amount of people that are subscribed right now. I want to bump that up. Kind of want 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And also, this is the current sub count. Let's try to get that up. We've gotten like probably like 40 subscribers from the last video. But uh, yeah, let's get into the video. So first, we're gonna start into game settings. All those sprint, you can have this as whatever you prefer. Mine is off. Auto open doors for me is on. Mantle activation, you want this to be on a hold jump. You do not want to add it. You do not want this as hold forward. Cause if you're basically just walking forward, you're just gonna automatically mantle, which is gonna mess you up in a whole bunch of scenarios. Hold weapon swap pickup, you want this to be on. Auto pick up weapons, this needs to be off. Preferred item slots. Now in this preferred item slots, you want this to be on. You always want preferred item slots on. So if you see, my slot one is shotgun, SMG, consumable, sniper, and assault rifle. Now if you're using the same settings as me, you want these to be all like this, or you'll just figure them out as you go. Reset building, these should all be on. And then auto confirm edits. If you're using my settings, you want this to be on edit. Some people don't like that. And then in your actual mouse, mouse sensitivity settings, you want your X and Y sensitivity to be exact same. So I would recommend if you're using 800 DPI, the 7.4 or to 8. And then target sensitivity is basically if you're opening it with an AR or something, or shotgun, you want this to be pretty high. Because with those, you don't really make, need to make that much micro adjustments. But for scope sensitivity, this is basically your sniper. You want, you want to be able to hit shots pretty easily and you need those micro adjustments. So have this at 35. And then for building edit, 180 and edit sensitivity 190 i would recommend these to be exactly the same or 10 off or ignore gamepad input and lock input method as mouse put these both on on if you don't use controller because if these are all off these are off you're gonna have more input delay on mouse keyboard and then mouse keyboard movement you put this on this is basically controller movement for mouse and keyboard of this on up in these settings right here and then inside your Keyboard and mouse settings. You don't need to really mess with any of this, but just change your sh uh, sprint to V and have your crouch to left shift or left control. And, and then for these, we're not really going to mess with these, but if you want to copy them, these are my settings right here. And then for crouch while building, you want this to be whatever your crouch was on your deck. You want wall to be either Q or Z, whatever your key is not your harvesting tool. So you Harvest of the cool could be either be Q or Z. And for floor, if you have thumb buttons on your mouse, you want these to be, you want both of these to be one of your thumb buttons. These are mine, but if you do not have thumb buttons, you can either use your number keys, you can use caps lock, or you can use alt for these, for these key buttons right here. Then your roof needs to be left control, whatever yours is not your crouch. And then trap, this is just cap, I use mine as caps lock. But like I said, if you don't want to use caps lock, you can alt. And for changing material, this would be right mouse button so you can have easy access to it. Building edit needs to be F or G, or most people have it as E, but any of those three will work. And if you guys don't know what scroll reset is, basically, if you edited a window, you can just press a button and it'll just reset it easily. And, and you can do that for a lot of things. And to get scroll reset, you want building edit to be mouse wheel down and then reset building edit to be mouse wheel down. But yeah, that's really it. Go check out some of my other videos. If you have a friend that plays controller, I have a video for that. And uh, yeah, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.